got breast cancer. First it was breast cancer and then it changed into lung cancer and the yoga took me through that terrible phase and six months later I was diagnosed as having breast cancer. We did chemotherapy together which was not very fun but it was still something that um, it was um, a, g a good experience overall. So it was always um, my treat and my joy to be able to share um, just any experience with her because she was just an amazing woman and to be able to have that privilege, it was a privilege to be able to spend uh, that time with her and to share that intimacy. The yoga did help me cope with losing my mother. It helped me cope with surgery and through chemotherapy and radiation. And I felt like after going through it that I would like to pass that on to other women. We all talk about the new normal after you go through cancer. And I was hoping to define that new normal and my experiment is to become a yoga instructor. The new normal is just when you have something major, and it doesn't have to be cancer, it can be a divorce or loss of a loved one, you have the rug pulled out from underneath you and you have to assess your life and decide what's important because you get a glimpse of the fact that life is so short and you better make good choices to figure out what you need to do to reposition yourself to be as happy as you possibly can be. So I get this wonderful idea about providing um, yoga for breast cancer survivors. However, if you build it, they don't necessarily come. So I contacted Living Beyond Breast Cancer because they do such a wonderful job of marketing and promoting various programs that will empower women going through breast cancer. 